Stephen Crane's The Red Badge of Courage and Selected Short Fiction delves into the complexities of human nature, fear, and courage in the context of war. Through a masterful interplay of vivid imagery, psychological insight, and a narrative style that captures the essence of the human experience, Crane crafts a compelling exploration of the internal and external struggles faced by individuals in the midst of conflict. At the heart of Crane's work is The Red Badge of Courage, a novel that follows the journey of Henry Fleming, a young soldier in the Union Army during the American Civil War. The narrative unfolds as Henry grapples with his own fears and aspirations, seeking to prove his mettle in the face of battle. Crane's portrayal of Henry's internal conflict provides a profound examination of the psychological toll of war on the individual. The title itself, The Red Badge of Courage, becomes a symbolic representation of the wounds sustained in battle and the perceived honor and validation that such wounds bring. Crane skillfully weaves this symbolism into the narrative, exploring how the external manifestation of courage, as represented by the Red Badge, intersects with the internal struggle for self-identity and validation. Crane's prose is marked by its realism and impressionistic qualities, immersing the reader in the chaotic and unpredictable nature of warfare. The vivid descriptions of battle scenes evoke a sense of immediacy and intensity, capturing the disorienting and disconcerting atmosphere of combat. The author's attention to detail extends beyond the physical aspects of war, delving into the emotional and psychological landscapes of the characters. Through Henry's journey, Crane raises questions about the nature of courage and the motivations that drive individuals to confront their deepest fears. The protagonist's initial idealized notions of heroism are shattered as he confronts the brutal reality of war. Crane challenges traditional notions of bravery, portraying courage not as a static virtue but as a fluid and evolving quality that emerges in the crucible of adversity. Crane's exploration of fear is equally compelling, as he delves into the intricate interplay between fear and courage within the human psyche. The author avoids simplistic dichotomies, presenting fear not as a weakness but as an inherent part of the human condition. Through Henry's internal monologues and reactions, Crane skillfully depicts the complex emotional terrain of a young soldier grappling with the terror of battle. In addition to The Red Badge of Courage, the collection includes selected short fiction that further showcases Crane's thematic preoccupations and stylistic prowess. Stories such as The Open Boat and The Blue Hotel exemplify Crane's ability to capture the essence of the human experience in different settings. Whether stranded at sea, facing the harsh elements, or navigating the tensions within a confined space, the characters in these short stories confront the challenges of their environments with a raw and unflinching realism. The Open Boat, in particular, reflects Crane's own experiences as a correspondent shipwrecked off the coast of Florida. The story transcends its specific context, becoming a meditation on the indifference of nature and the existential struggle for meaning in the face of adversity. Crane's depiction of the character's shared plight underscores the inherent interconnectedness of human experience, even in the most dire circumstances. In conclusion, Stephen Crane's The Red Badge of Courage and Selected Short Fiction stands as a testament to the enduring power of literature to explore the depths of human experience. Through his nuanced portrayal of war, fear, and courage, Crane invites readers to contemplate the complexities of the human psyche in the ways in which individuals navigate the challenges of their existence. The timeless themes and evocative prose in this collection continue to resonate, offering a poignant and thought-provoking exploration of the human condition.